Hey everyone, I'm Demich. And I'm Ty the Guy 2800. Here with a quick podcast. Now this one's going to be on the Kirby Star Allies demo, and I'm a pretty big Kirby fan. It's one of my favorite Nintendo series, and seeing one on the Switch made me really happy. However, I finally got to play the demo, and my thoughts might surprise you a little bit. Hmm. Interesting. And I think my thoughts are relatively the same, uh, maybe a little bit less <clears throat> harsh. Now, the latest Kirby game was Kirby Planet Robobot, and I just absolutely loved that game. It kept the Kirby formula while introducing new things like the robot mechanic and new abilities for Kirby, and it had some unique level design, like a city, you had the robot mechanical theme, and I thought it was overall a great game. Now, going from Kirby Planet Robobot to Star Allies, I hate to say it, I know I'm going to get a lot of flack for this, but it just felt uninspired. Sure, the game looks beautiful, but Robobot ran at 60 frames per second without the 3D on. I don't know why this game runs at 30 frames per second, because it really hindered the experience for me. I, th I think uh, the main reason is because um, the majority of the game is you playing with four other either CPUs or four other friends. And I guess in order to um, try to keep everything on the screen running at a smooth rate, they lowered it to 30 frames because uh, I'd imagine whatever engine they're using, uh, if there's multiple characters on the screen at one time, the 60 frames will kind of dip. Um, it didn't bother me that much. I did notice it a lot. And at first it was kind of jarring, but after you play it a little bit, I think it's okay. The main gripe I have with it are those loading screens. They are atrocious. That's, it's, it's unexcusable at, at, at the least. Like, it completely breaks up the pace. Um, it's unnecessary. And I don't even think uh, it should, it's even needed to be there. <sighs> I agree with you there, but I'm not sure if that's just for the demo to introduce you to the game, but if that's through the whole game, it's going to totally ruin the pace of it. But other than those major gripes, I thought the game was fun. I think it had some cool level design. I liked the combining the power-ups ability, the star allies, that was all cool. I liked the presentation of the game, and I'm probably going to get it. You know, it's a Kirby game on the Switch, but at the same time, I really expected a little more from Nintendo. You know, I think I might, um, I might not buy this one. Uh, it's not because I don't like Kirby. I just don't see myself spending sixty bucks on this title. Uh, I feel, I, I feel like, uh, you know, the combining power-ups thing is kind of cool, but it kind of feels recycled at the same time. If you know what I mean. Uh, there's other games in the Kirby series that have done this. Obviously, Kirby. 64. I, I mean, it's different, but it's still the same concept. Kirby Squeak Squad, uh, mixing power-ups down in the touchscreen. Uh, Kirby Superstar as well, I believe. Uh, I don't know. I haven't... I'm going to be truthful with you. Uh, I haven't been crazy about any Kirby games since... Uh, Return of Dreamland? No. I, actually, I... I didn't even like Return to Dreamland that much. Uh, Triple Deluxe? No, I wasn't crazy about that one either. Sweet Squad? It was probably... No, it was probably since uh, Superstar Ultra. Um, that's that's a really high bar. And I don't really expect them to hit that anytime soon. Again, Triple Deluxe is a good game. You haven't played Return Robobot, then. <laughs> I, I, ha I haven't. I haven't. I have yet to play that one. Uh... Well, I don't know. I just feel like it's, it's... Every time I see Kirby, it's the same. Nothing really changes. And whether that be for the better, for the worse, uh, there was kind of a reason why I was saying I wanted to see a uh, 3D Kirby game. And you know what? After playing the Star Allies demo, I couldn't agree with you more. But overall, I gotta say the demo was not good, but not bad either. It's a <laughs> game that I'll definitely consider getting, but at the same time, it's just very samey to me very recycled and I'm kind of disappointed about that but if I had to rate the demo I'd give it 5 out of 5 average um I'll give it one more higher I'll give it a 7 out of 10 I didn't think it was that bad that would uh, be yeah. two more higher it was average 5 out of 5 is average not good not bad mm, I, 
think it was pretty good for what it was. I don't know. Um, I'm, I'm not going to be too harsh on it. It's just a demo. I will, I will grade it as is when the full game comes out in a few weeks. Well, anyways, that about wraps it up. I'm Demetri. I'm Tyler Guy 2800. Peace.